River flooding in several areas of mid-Michigan. Yeah, flooding damaging some nearby homes. News 10's Deanna Giles spoke with one neighbor of the flooded area impacted by those waters and shares how you can protect your home. From ice cold temperatures to numbers in the 40s, the ice from rivers are causing floods across mid-Michigan. Brett Bender and his family in Portland woke up to an unexpected surprise. It was uh, definitely about a foot of water by the end of the driveway. There's a good three, four, eight, maybe five feet of water in the backyard. Uh, whole basement flooded. The basement of Bender's home completely flooded, covering the furnace and electric panel. We were all just um, get everything off the floor, get what you can, get, get what you can, and let's get out of here. But then we started thinking about how many animals we have all the stuff we had to bring. Mounds of ice from the Grand River now on land and home backyards submerged in water. That's why restoration companies say it's important to maintain your sump pumps. In the first few hours, you definitely want to get a restoration company on site um, and, and call a plumber because you want to get the sump pump fixed and then get the water out. It's also important to have an evacuation plan in place in case of emergencies. Portland City Manager Tut Gorman says it's hard to determine the extent of damages because of the ice. The problem is trying to predict flooding when you have a lot of ice. Uh, you don't know how the ice is going to shift and you don't know how often it's going to melt. And so trying to be predict those things are very difficult. Anytime it melts and it gets warm and cold, um, that the water's got to go somewhere. For now, Bender's priority is making sure the house is not damaged. In Portland, Deanna Giles, News 10. Now, the flood warning has been lifted for Portland, although Clinton and Livingston counties are still under a flood warning for the Maple River at Maple Rapids and the Huron River near Hamburg. A 19-year-old woman is recovering.